Good morning, everyone. Uh, having a look at uh, the uh, first reading today, St. Paul's letter to the Ephesians, chapter 4. And he says there, Be friends with one another, and kind, forgiving each other as readily as God forgave you in Christ. Now, remember that St. Paul, once again, is writing to people in the early church, and the people of Ephesus, obviously, were those where there was some discord between the the Jews and the Gentiles. There was also discord between the early Christians and and the pagans and heathens. Now, um, difficulty in terms of saying, well, okay, be friends with one another. In society today, I think uh, often with developing our need to, to be the best we can be, we become quite competitive. Uh, and then very soon you discover that you have got enemies uh, or people who are promoting something that you don't necessarily support. It fascinates me when there's a, a sporting event on how you'll find that people are so aggressive for an hour and a half or so while they're playing each other on the field. And at the end of the game, they'll all shake hands and they'll go off and have a drink together. Um, and and it, it's, you say, well, their, their, their actions on the, on the field uh, or on the playing area or because of the rules of that game. But once they finish that, then they move into a different life. And there you can be friends with your enemies, if you like. And I think that sometimes we, we allow ourselves to be drawn into such a situation that we, uh, we allow world values to dictate the way in which we um, practice our religious beliefs. So it's, it's a very difficult one because uh, you obviously want to be recognized and you want to get ahead. But in Christianity, it's not about that. Christianity is all about making your friend the one who gets ahead, making sure that they are the best. And I'm always reminded that uh, St. Paul also tells us that we have different gifts and different abilities for the benefit of all, not just for our own benefit. It's not a question of saying, look how well I've done. But in fact, how well have we done for others? How others benefited from uh, what we have um, contributed. So to be, be friends with others, try not to, to find reasons for there to be friction. And if there's some difficulties in your life at the moment, perhaps now's a good time to sort those out. So you have a wonderful day and uh, look after yourselves. We'll see you again. God bless. Bye-bye.